Hi, my name is Emily Browning, and I'm a CPA by trade, a wife, and a mother to two sweet and wild little boys. A little over two years ago, it was tax season. I was um, working insane hours. Never saw my children because I was at, you know, I was at work before they got to, before they woke up and didn't get home until they were in bed. And I rarely saw my husband. And the only thing I wanted to do when I got off at night was crawl under the covers and dream of a vacation. But God had other plans for me. I was always really impressed with my other friends who had Rodan and Fields businesses, how successful they were, but still they were normal, crazy busy people just like I was. So when my sister-in-law wanted some opinions on, or some suggestions on how she could make some extra money, I knew exactly what she should do. So I called my friend Stephanie for her and got all the goods, but little did I realize that my husband was sitting on the couch and all of a sudden he pops up with, hey, you need to do this too and then you and April can work it together. And I was like, absolutely not. Um, I, I'm a CPA for a reason. <laughs> it's because I am not a salesperson. Not to mention, I am insanely busy, so when in the world will I ever have time to do this? So I argued with him and fought with God. We prayed about it, prayed about it, um, and decided to finally take the leap of faith. I started sharing this business and these products with excitement and 60 days later hit the top of the pay plan. Um, never would I imagine that, you know, just two weeks after that, that my brother would be re-diagnosed with brain cancer. And thanks to, you know, the hard work that I had put in initially and my teams that God would provide the equivalent to my CPA income so that I didn't have to worry about money while I spent those last four months with David in April. Could have never imagined that I would have, or that we would have thousands and thousands of people praying for us that didn't know me, April, or David because that's exactly the type of people that make up this company. And never in a million years would I have guessed that just seven short months after starting my Rodan and Fields business that I would retire from corporate America at 35. And to top it all off, I'm recording that from my brand new shiny white free Lexus that my team qualified for um, this April. So, you know, it doesn't, success in this business is not dependent on where you're from, how many people you already know doing it, or your background. All you need to do to be successful in this business is a reason why and the courage to take that first step. Thank you.